I'll show you how to troubleshoot a problem in Windows 7, 8 and 10 when your computer loads with a blank screen and a cursor. No desktop icons, personal files and no taskbar. In Windows 7 you can actually see the background image, but in Windows 10 it's just a black screen and a cursor. This may happen because the process explorer didn't start properly, due to some various reasons like viruses or just corrupted system files. First of all, let's run Task Manager and then start the process. On your keyboard, press and hold the Shift and Control keys, and while holding them, press Escape. Go to File, New Task, and simply type Explorer, and press Enter. So, I hope you can see all your stuff now, and by the way, you can stop this process deliberately. Select Explorer and click End Task. In Windows 10 you have an option to restart the process or right-click and task. Finally, let's check the Windows Registry key to prevent this problem from happening again. Press and hold the Windows key and then press R. Now type REG Edit Command and press Enter. Now go to the following location. You have to check the value of shell. It should be only explorer.exe. If you see something else, whatever it is, double click, simply delete and leave only explorer.exe. I would also recommend to run check disk just in case of corrupted files. You can also run the System File Checker tool to restore missing or corrupted system files. Click Start and type CMD. Right-click and run as administrator. Type SFC space slash scan now and press Enter. This command will scan all protected system files and replace corrupted or modified files with a cached copy that is located in a compressed folder. 